Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. Happy Tuesday. We did it. We did the second half of our last case of Museum Collection Baseball. Pick your team, number Sweet 16. So big thanks to all of these for, for getting to the action. Stephen K, Last Spot Mojo Rockies. And there's everybody else. Thank you, everyone. And as a little bit of a thank you for everybody who joined this break, and, you know, there's a lot of new releases tomorrow on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Every little bit of break credit helps. So we're giving away 40 bucks of break credit at the end of this break. So I'll randomize everybody's names at the end. And we'll see who gets it. Good luck, everybody. First box, break 16. Rory saying, whatever team gets the lowest numbered hit this break, Lance Machado. All right, good luck, everybody. Steven Strasburg, 99. We'll sleeve these up now. We'll top load those before they get shipped out. First half of this case was pretty amazing. I'm hoping that we'll see more amazingness in the second half of this case. All right, we got Ted Williams revealing Jake, Silence of the Lambs, 16 out of 25. Triple relic and autograph for Joe P. and his Diamondbacks. So snakes on the board early. No worries, Chris Rowe. Quad relic for the Metropolitan, Syndergaard, DeGrom, Cespedes, and Conforto. 12 out of 99 for Vic and the Mets. Trey Turner reveals a Ryan McMahon out of 299. Last spot mojo. Stephen K with the Rockies. They were just sitting there for a while. Ryan McMahon has a really nice auto, too. And then we've got Josh Donaldson, 30 out of 50, two-color patch for the Blue Jays. And that'll be for Stephen K. There you go. All right, next box. Full disclosure. Um, full disclosure, Freeman, or uh, the Freeman? Frame already pulled. Not Freeman. It wasn't even Freeman. It was David Ortiz. And the Jumbo Patch Auto already uh, already pulled as well. But I'm still looking, I still feel like there's going to be some nice low numbered hits here too. And so once again, Rory saying that whatever team gets the lowest numbered hit in this break lands Manny Machado in real life. Toronto in the lead. That's a low, That's already a low number. 30 out of 50? I'll probably get lower than that, right? Are the other ones higher than 30? Yeah, I guess they were. No, we had a... Tw Does this... We had Jake Lent, 16, 12. 
Or are you saying on the right side? There's 12 or 50, I guess. I don't know. Rory will keep track of this. Whatever, whatever, whatever you want to use, Rory. All right, let's play two out of 150, 140 out of 150. All right, Rafael Devers reveals. Nice, Tom Glavin, 10 out of 15. Two color patch and autograph. I feel like that's our second big jumbo relic and auto. That goes to Vic and the Metropolitans. Remember when Tom Glavin was a Met, ladies and gentlemen? Remember when he was almost a hockey player? There's the babe, baby Ruth, revealing another Met. 46 out of 75, David Wright. Four pieces of his lumber. Behind Reggie Jackson is another Met. Look at that. He's heating up. He's on fire. 162 out of 199. The straw man. Daryl Strawberry. Clean sweep. Let's find out. Ernie Banks reveals. Is it going to be a Met? No, it's not. But it's an 8 out of 10. Dustin Pedroia. Nice one for the Bow Sox. Mario with the Red Sox. Nice low numbered laser show. There you go. So this half of the case de delivering some solid hits. All right, next side. Game is tied. Scooter. Why don't I cut horizontally straight across? I don't know, because that's just how I do it, Bill. When you start your own breaking channel, you can you can cut it however you would like. guy still cracks me. I don't even know what his name is but still cracks me up out of 150 Ryan Braun out of 50 Eric Hosmer yeah who's gonna walk it off it's already the bottom of the ninth Nobody, want, nobody wants to see extra innings in, in the All-Star game, right? Does that mean Ross Stripling would get the win? If there's a walk-off? All right, Victor Robles reveals a big jumbo relic. Four out of five, Michael Conforto. Woo! I, I feel like there were zero Mets in the first half. Crushing in the second half. Vic, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! All right, and behind Reese Hoskins is staying in New York. 49 out of 299. Didi Gregorius going to the Bronx. From Queens to the Bronx. You just take the. The L 
from the I don't know. I'm an I'm an LA guy. Kofax <laughs> revealing the new Kofax, Clayton Kershaw, 60 out of 75. Looks like Father's Day patch right here. That goes to Paul Cool Whit and my Dodgers. And behind Dave Winfield Padres edition is Brian Dozier, 85 out of 99. Is Jesus Aguilar going to walk this off? Then I'd be okay with Jesus Aguilar beating out Max Muncy for the final vote. All right. Gilo with a notification of the Dodgers closing on Machado. It's, they, they've been, uh, I think that's been the buzz the entire day. Bob Nightingale reporting that or tweeting that it was closed. Ken Rosenthal pretty, pretty much saying it's all but over. And I think ESPN picked up on that same news. Oh, that was close. Um, so that's the that's the rumor. But it's not official yet. Yeah, Eric Bailey's even saying that the Phillies are allegedly still in on the, the action. Muncy would have went yard, Jose. Muncy would have went yard. If only they got only if only he got in for final vote with the final vote instead of Jesus Aguilar. All right. Out of 99. Uh, Chilo saying the the All-Star game going to penalty kicks. It could go get a penal. Muncy would have Muncy would have struck out. Muncy actually has one of the best pitch recognition in the league, Rory. I think. I don't think he strikes out very often. That's one of his one of his uh, one of his qualities. Mike K saying Yahoo Sports says it's a done deal. It's not a done deal until at Dodgers or uh, any of their represent or any of their agents report uh, say it's a done deal. All right, Greg put a bird on it. Four out of 50, pinstripe patch. Behind Anthony Rizzo is Matt Olson. It looks like he hesitated a little bit right there on the auto. 133 out of 299. Paul Cool Whit with that one. Aaron Judge reveals another Met, Yoenna Cespedes, out of 35 this time. Mets crushing. Here you go, Vic. And behind Astros edition of Nolan Ryan is primary pieces, Rick Porcello. 14 out of 25, Rick Porcello. <laughs> In Italiano, maybe Rick Porcello. I guess in Espanol, Rick Porceo. There you go. That's for the Red Sox. That'll go to Mario. All right. Next box. Good luck. Come on, Ross. Oh, 
from a W to a possible L. Ross, you might see him in the... This is like... This is World Series Nightmare all over again. This is this is this is giving me World Series flashbacks. <sighs> like, I feel like like getting like post traumatic stress disorder, some sort of syndrome happening here. Javier Baez out of one fit, my eyes like twitching, bringing back bad memories. Uh, out of 99, Mike Piazza, Mets edition. Unless this is the only way I can comfort myself. I know. I'm, the only way I can comfort myself is uh, is if Ross Stripling is playing the long game. Where, where Stripling is just like, oh yeah, I'm, I'm going to face these guys in the World Series later this year. So I'm going to pretend like they can hit off me. But then... Uh, not that anyone cares about an all-star game, right, you guys? Pfft. No one cares about an all-star game. It's just an exhibition game. It doesn't mean anything. Dozier, again, this time out of 25. Twinkies. That'll be for Paul Coolwit. Ken Rosenthal said it's a done deal. I, I'll wait until the Dodgers say it's a done deal. I don't think Ken Rosenthal represents the Dodgers or Manny Machado in this. There's Craig Kimbrell, 161 out of 299. Behind Kyle Schwarber is Paul Goldschmidt, 15 out of 75. That's a cool patch right there. There you go, Joe P. and his snakes with that one. And behind the reproduction of Jimmy Fox is David Price. Five out of 25. Now, I'm not going to scream like a girl, G-Lo, if Machado gets added. Now, if Machado, if Machado um, is the reason why we win the World Series, then yes, I will scream like a girl. Then it was on Dodger DodgerNation.com, not the Dodgers' official page. I know a lot of people are reporting it. Apparently, it is, but I won't believe it until it's confirmed by official sources, either Manny Machado himself, the Dodgers organization themselves. Or, or the agent of Manny Machado. DodgerNation.com. I think that's like some, some a group of fans. Just a group of fans. Actually, yeah, good, good call, Eric Bailey. Um, we gotta wait for TMZ to report Machado deals, and then I'll believe it. Gotta have good pitching to win the World Series, Joe. I know. Dodgers have good pitching. No, Ross Tripling will not be on that. Uh, on that. If if CNN reports, if CNN reports that uh, that officials that the Dodgers front office quoted as saying that Machado is here, then I will believe. Out of one fifty. Yeah, Stripley won't be on the postseason roster, Joe P. Clearly. 
Actually, the Dodgers issue is the uh, is the middle relief. All right, we got Victor Martinez at 35 for the Tigres. Stephen K with the Tigers. Al Kaline, very popular Tiger. And Eric River Thames, three out of 50 for Rory and his brew crew. There you go, Rory. There's Johnny Bench with primary pieces. Adam Wainwright, 46 out of 99. Waino going to Jarrett and the cards. And last but not least, behind Freddie Freeman is... Two-color dual relic Michael Fulmer, 006 out of 199. Uh, he was a rookie of the year a couple years ago, Stephen K. Then some arm issues. Then making his way back. Could still be a solid part of that Tigers rotation in the future. And there you have it, boys and girls. Museum 16 in the books. Thanks very much, everyone. 40 bucks break credit being given away. So let's fire up random.org. And let's see what we got. So let's get everyone's names from Joe P down to Chris Rowe with the Nats and everybody in between. Let's slide this up right here. Let's roll the dice and let's randomize that list three and a five, eight times. Name on top. We'll get the break credit after eight times. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, and eighth and final time after eight times. Name on top. Clyde the Glide. No doubt about it. He had the top two spots. So there you go, Clyde. Thanks very much, Joe, for jazbeeshobbyland.com. We will see you next time for the next break. I think we're I think we're out of tops baseball tonight, right? No, we got Stadium Club left if you want to do some Stadium Club, ladies and gentlemen. And we have a brand new release tomorrow, Allen and Ginter Baseball by Tops. JaspiesHobbyland.com. We'll see you for that break. Bye-bye.